Hello everyone, today we are going to migrate an old project to the version catalog. So let's start by saying why this is a good option. So if you have a multi-module architecture application, this will be handy because you can store all the dependencies in one file and then use it across the, all the modules. So let's jump into build Gradle from the Android Studio and let's migrate this file. So let's switch to the project view in the Gradle, hit new, file, libs, dot versions, oops, versions, dot tom l. And now we need to save versions, oops, this is the libraries and the last one is plugins. Okay, so we separated them in three sections. The versions will contain the libraries and plugins versions. This, one, this will contain only the dependencies and the plugins, of course, only the plugins. So let's go to build.gradle.kts and now all of those are highlighted with yellow. So we can hit Alt Enter and replace with new library catalog declaration. And for some of them will not work for some others will remove the platform so let's hit alt enter replace and also use the platform again oops now let's these ones won't work okay j unit is working this one and okay those aren't working so let's simply take them so compose ui graphics simply copy and let's make a module this is the dependency name and the version dot ref will be take from here so let's create the um android x oops compose ui graphics equals this block um, we don't actually need the version ref because it has already one from the Compose BOM. Let's take this one to simply duplicate duplicate by Control uh, and D. Let's replace the module with this one. Tooling preview. So tooling preview. Um, test J unit. This is test J unit four. Okay. Uh, tooling and the uh, test manifests. So let's double test manifest and uh, tooling. And this one is tooling. Okay. Now let's go back here and let's simply say libs dot android x. Um, I forgot which one is this uh, UI dot graphics libs dot android x compose. Okay, I forgot this one has compose to. Um, UI tooling preview. I think it will be easier to sync and have an autocomplete for this one. So let's wait a second. Um, compose. Oh, I put AA in the yeah, okay. Let's try again. What's the problem? Okay, so simply comment this out, try again. Uncomment these ones and let's see what is the problem. Compose.
it's compo android oh i forgot to add uh, add an, a d okay now it should work so it's ui dot graphics why is not working android x compose ui graphics let's sync okay i thought i made a mistake again so let's say libs dot android x compose ui test and j unit 4 let's delete this one android x compose ui and tooling and the last one let's copy this and simply pass test manifest Um, now let's go into build upgrader from the project and let's also migrate these ones so we simply take the plugin let's make an agp for the android gradle plugin 8.2.2 the android application is id equal this one and the version dot ref is agp um the kotlin version okay kotlin is 1.9.10 kotlin id as the id version dot ref is kotlin and the gms let's see 4.34.15 and the plugin is this one so gms id is okay and the version dot ref is gms oh these are older yeah but i'm not replacing them right now in order to use the version catalog here we need to use alias and let's say libs.plugins.agp uh, sorry android application let's also sync to have autocomplete okay now let's say alias libs.plugins dot kotlin and remove the version and the last one is alias libs.plugins and gms we can copy these ones and go into the android view and in the build upgrader from the app module and replace them here and remove the apply okay so let's sync now and see if we have any errors okay we don't have any error errors so this is perfect and if you like this video make sure to subscribe for more content like this and see you in the next video